My name is Erin Morrow. Um, I'm married to Zach. We have four sons and I am one of the junior girls, small group leaders at the Bridge Student Ministry and this is my sixth year doing that. <laughs> I'm Kate. I'm Presley. And I'm Gabby. She's like our, she's the leader that's been with us. We've had like four youth leaders mm -hmm. and she's been the one that's been with us for these past five years. Um, I'd never done any kind of student ministry before and when I was approached about it, you know, I was nervous because I'm the age of some of the girls' moms. I wasn't sure if they would like me or if I would be able to fit into my schedule. But having done this for six years now, being able to see those relationships grow and to watch these girls grow in their relationship with Christ and, um, and to sharpen, uh, like iron sharpening iron, I've been able to grow in my relationship with Christ through them. I think I would tell her that these girls like need her more than she knows and that like even in sixth grade when I didn't really I probably wouldn't have told Erin that like I needed her in my life but um, <clears throat> like now as a junior like thinking about if Erin wouldn't have been like I can't imagine yeah. it's weird like just thinking about like if she wasn't our leader just because of the impact the, that, the amount yeah of love that she's just poured into every single one of us. And we have a whole bunch of girls in our small group. And so just a lot of love and lots of love. I think probably early on in the second year, um, there was a situation, there was one Wednesday night and it was over and all the girls were leaving. Um, and one pulled me aside and told me about something that was going on in her personal life. Um, she didn't want to talk about it in front of the other girls, which I understood and respected. Um, but she asked me to pray for her and I did in that moment. And you know, that was kind of a time where I really realized, okay, like by God's grace, like I'm making a difference. You know, they feel like I'm someone they can, they can tell their troubles to and someone they can confide in. And so I think that was a moment for me that really stood out. Having friendship, especially at our age, is just such a beautiful and awesome thing to have. Um, and so just having it with somebody like older than you, I think it's just really like, not like a mom daughter bond, but like just having that intentional relationship with her is just really, it's just really fun and awesome. Superhero dodgeball is super fun. Our group wins a lot of the games. Like I don't want to use the word dynasty, but you could if you wanted to. Um, but honestly, the best memories are just the Wednesday nights. We come in and you know we kind of talk about our week, and you kind of see the girls shedding their worries and their troubles, and we can just talk and we can open up God's word. And, and leave a little bit closer to him, leave feeling refreshed, leave feeling like we've had real community. Um, so honestly, those Wednesday nights have been just the best. They're times that I will treasure for the rest of my life, absolutely. I never really thought like I could be the one like standing in front of people, like being like, hey y'all, let's come together, do this little dance and all that. So she's really showed me how like outgoing I truly am and that I can really just like bring people together if I really tried. I think no matter, every time we bring up like a struggle of ours, like she's always very um, relatable and like doesn't ever make us feel alone or isolated in our struggles. Um, I, don't, I don't feel like there's anything I could tell Erin that she would be like, what? Like, you know, like she's always mm -hmm. very like open armed and um, willing to listen and then she always just understands like yeah I'm like how does this person understand everything and even I'm if she doesn't understand she's like okay explain it to me more <laughs> and then I'll try to yeah figure it out with you mm -hmm. I would say like to sum it up that like I love Erin so much and I know that God loves me because of the way that she loves us I think I would just say if you feel God calling you to be a part in any type of ministry at the bridge, um, just say yes. You won't regret it. The, the blessings will far outweigh um, the time that it takes and the effort that you put into it. Um, so yeah, just do it. <laughs>